Hello everybody, this is Glenda and Buster with aka GK Fralin of Friendly Community. And our Friendly Community welcomes you. He's so good at that. Today we've got a whole bunch of film of us doing what? Being out on the porch. It was so nice and warm. It was beautiful. It was a beautiful day. That and some updates on the challenge. See, there's neighbor kids out playing. And there's just all kinds of activity today. Because it's in the 60s. I think that's a good idea. I like it too. That's good. Ah. Oh, I love hearing those kids playing. That is sweet. That is sweet. <laughs> kids are out of school, and little kids are out on the, in the yards with their moms and dads, those that are home from work. It is so beautiful. This is the way the weather's supposed to be now. By the way, if you did not see John Hampton, the man from Oz, yesterday's vlog, go see it. It's, well, for one thing, it's a thumbs up for him because he don't have cancer. But he also answered the challenge for either favorite flower or an Easter egg thing. And he answered it in a, such a funny, cute way. You really need to go see it. Anyway. So. He's, he's, a, he's a character. That's what he is. He likes to be a character. And we like that about him. Character in a good way. He just, he's, he kind of likes to joke around. He just says goofy things, which is fine. One day he talked about funny ways people smile. <laughs> anyway. I uh, kind of got to love him. And then Mia, she's doing her own puppet with, with her glitter, the unicorn. And golly. Oh, and there's Baby Newton Sings. And he sings, and he's cute, and he's funny. Oh, he's a puppet. And he just sings so cute. Hurly burly, that's what he's saying. Yesterday, I think, very cute. Because the, the other singer was in a split screen. And <laughs> it was so cute. Haven't heard that song in so long. Actually, this battery is lasting for a little while. I'm kind of glad. I hope it's picking up some of the sounds from outside rather than just the one from inside. But, whichever, it's a beautiful day. Somebody just got dropped off from work or something. But she's wearing a very pretty dress. The long dresses are really, they're really coming back because they're so comfortable. 
Golly, guys, these, they're just comfortable as can be. Don't have to worry about wearing jeans and all that tightness around the waist. They're just, they're comfy, they're easy. Love them. At least as long as they're in style enough to where the stores are carrying them. Oh, <laughs> uh, isn't that the way it is, though? Buster, you're just laying there. You haven't done anything with me yet. Oh, I'm doing it now. Okay. But it's not much. <laughs> you watching the kids play? Yeah, they're cute. I'd sure like to talk to them sometime. Well, they'd have to be, their parents would have to be willing to let them come over and, and watch Buster the Puppet. And talk to Buster the Puppet. But, you know, we haven't asked either. Oh. Somebody picking their little one up from the babysitter. Yep. There's cars going by. The one mom had to run and get the other little one who was running after the other one who was leaving because there was a car coming. That's what mothers do. Yep. Although my mom, she never had to do that. She, you never, well, you never got big enough to chase a car or anything, did you? Nope. Did you ever get where you weren't supposed to? Yep. <laughs> What'd your mom do? She went after me. She got the skin on the back of my neck, put in her mouth, real gentle like. I kind of got somewhat paralyzed. And she just carried me back to where I was supposed to be. It's kind of the way a lot of animals carry their young. You, I kind of know that. I'm from the animal kingdom, you know. <laughs> I do know. But sometimes it's easy to forget because you have such a personality. Thank you. Thank you, thank you, thank you, thank you. I have got a hair that's hanging around. It's hanging right down here. I can see it. It's right across my eye or something. There it is. It's right across my eyelash. Always looks like it's out of here, but it's right there. <laughs> I don't have any eyelashes. I could give you some. No thanks. <laughs> The tongue and the tail are very nice. That's all I need. Okay. What about the toys? I like them too. Don't take them away. <laughs> oh, it isn't it nice to be out here. You keep saying it's wonderful. I love it. It's so pretty. It'll be nice when the trees get leaves on them. Yes, it will. It'll be really nice. Hmm. Oh, I think he moved his truck. I don't know what he's doing. I haven't been paying attention. But I ain't here to snoop. I'm here to snoop around. What do you do when you're sitting on a screen and porch if you're not looking around the neighborhood? I don't know. Look at your toes. <laughs> oh, yeah. <laughs> I got some socks on at least. That's good, because you got an ugly toe. <laughs> yeah, I do. I got a, I got an ugly toe. Say. Well, there's my daffodil. <laughs> Such as it is, I decided to go ahead and finish it. And I'll let you see it. I'm not sure how daffodil leaves look, so I just kind of went on my own. <laughs> these are some 
This is Carla's tulip picture. It's kind of a fancy one, but I like the little mushroom down at the bottom, the little toadstool that it's shading. <laughs> that is this cute. I love this picture. Kind of whimsical. What do you think of those pictures, Buster? I like that. I didn't think your daffodil was terrible. Mm, not terrible. If it was, I wouldn't have put it on there. I literally did like those tulips. <laughs> those are cute. <laughs> but anyway, I like them. I hope people send more. I do too. You know what? <sighs> this challenge is really, it is going places. And I like that. Me too. Oh, hey, are you going to be doing any more puppetry with the little green Martian thing on Jiggy? Sorry, I'm messing with you. Yeah, you're always messing with me. I'm messed with all the time. <laughs> no. No, I'm not going to be doing any more of those. You got enough characters in that bean of yours. You don't need any more. <laughs> hey, that wasn't nice. Why is it so funny to you then? Aww. Because you're funny. <laughs> She's got enough craziness in that at her. She don't need more. <laughs> Oh, uh, yeah. <laughs> but it's my, it's my charm. Uh-huh. My charm? Oh, don't give me that face. <laughs> I can't turn my head upside down like you can. Nope, it don't work too good. Yours is ratcheted on too well. <laughs> I tell you, some days, <laughs> some days, what? You gonna take me off and leave me behind? No, I wouldn't do that. Oh, I'm so glad I love you so much. Oh, don't. <laughs> I'm glad you love me, but don't. <laughs> oh, he is cracking me up now, and that's the problem. Shall we say goodbye? Since the, the phone just did that noise. Yep, let's see. <laughs> Good night, everybody. She's so funny. Don't you just love her? Love her? That's... <laughs> I know what you mean. Anyway, love you. I love all of you, and keep smiling, smile, 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 and that's as much as I know, and it wasn't so good, <clears throat> it wasn't so bad either, just giving her trouble, folks, good night, be be willing to give somebody else a good day. Shake their hand with a good grip. You know, that is good advice. We don't want to squeeze, the, squeeze their hands too tight, but you want to make sure that you don't get this clammy thing in out there. Well, that's true. I've never given anybody a cold paw. I bet you haven't. Good night, everybody. Good night. Love you. <laughs>